Hey, good morning, church. Welcome to Time with Children. <laughs> kind of think I'm crazy, don't you? <laughs> but I found a story about laughter in the Bible. Would you like to join with me? <laughs> Let's do our investigative work. How about that, huh? So I need my investigative glasses. Let me see. Oh, I got my, that's the wrong hat, but it is left. <laughs> my investigative hat and my investigative jacket. Because we're going to talk about a story we found in the Old Testament. It's in the very beginning. Matter of fact, it's the first book of the Bible. In the book of Genesis. Genesis uh, 17, 18, around there, there's a story about a time when someone laughed at God. Laughed at God? Oh my goodness. Yes, I even found it in Miss Betty Jo's book. Let me see, it was on page 12. It says, Sarah laughed at God. Laughed at God. You know why? Because <laughs> God came to them and said they would have a child. Oh my goodness. Abraham, when he was about, he was a hundred years old at the time. And Sarah was very old time too. And she was saying, no way, God. No way you're going to have us have a baby at this age. Can you imagine? Yes. But you know what? God saved that promise. It says here in the book, it says, where is your wife, God asked. She is going to have a child soon. In the tent, Sarah heard this and laughed. She was much too old to have a children. Well, why does she laugh, God asked. Nothing is too difficult for me. At the time, she will have a baby. <laughs> hey, you know what? That reminds me a long time ago when uh, we found out we were having twins, you know, our fourth and fifth baby. Oh, oh, my goodness. I laughed from Woodbury all the way up to Cherry Hill. I laughed and laughed and laughed. I said, oh, God, you're so funny. Our fourth and fifth baby was going to be twins. Oh, oh, my goodness. It's kind of like that because sometimes we need to just laugh. We just need to laugh at things and know that God is in control of what's going on. So... A good hearty laugh, you know, I do laugh to yoga, which is kind of a mind thing where you just seize the day and just laugh and know God is in control. Let's pray about that. Father God, boy, we really need to laugh more and enjoy your glory on us. If you said something's going to happen and we think it's impossible, we just need to laugh at two of that impossibility and know that you're going to be doing it for us, Lord. We just thank you for that. Lord, thank you for everything provided for us, and thank you for the gift of laughter. <laughs> in Jesus' precious name, amen. Hey, guys, can I get you to laugh? <laughs> Don't forget, wash your hands. Because you don't want to get the corona. Bye-bye. <laughs>